look at this one. This is my one, and that's the bamboo stick. It's a local village grilled fish with lao khao, Thai whiskey. Everything together. Today we are going to harvest a bamboo shoot up in the mountain near my house. My first time though, I look like professional do I? So let's go with my mom. We already have one pot over here but we're gonna go up and show you how we have a second. Nay man nuta pai yam hai. This one is yam. Yam made from a bag of fertilizer. They used to have like a fertilizer here and then the farmer would be cutting it in shapes, sewing it together and make it as a bag. So guys, homemade, does it look good on me? Let's go! Going to the bush. Going in the bush. <laughs> Yay, we made it. Up to the mountain. Funny thing, I go to the mountain all the time when I was looking. Man, we long been cow long you told I four or five. I start go up the mountain high. Went with my cousin. And we'd be like picnic, buy uh pack everything. Huh? Lu Bung. My mom said, you see this hole? It's one type of um I think ground spider. I'll I'm not sure what his name is, but it was huge. It looked like spider. So there are two ways to burn the to cook the bamboo, burn and boil. I think we found one. Oh, why so small? Ah. Like a stick. What? Can ya? It's so tiny. Normally it's bigger than this. All right, look at this one. This is my one, and that's the bamboo stick. Wow, it smells so nice. And then they peel it, so they leave, they tear off the peel, the peel, and then they get the pure bamboo shoot inside. Let's go a little bit further. We're not gonna hike, my mom just say. We're just gonna do it for fun, <laughs> to show you guys, because she's already come up hiking. Look at the, the dog. Oh here, I'll show you all the bamboo. You see this? Okay, I'm gonna go and break the bamboo. Oh ho, kinku! Oh ho, look at this. You guys see this? You guys see that? That's the real side. Millipi. Real side, giant one, they eat bamboo. Oh, then that one. Another one over there. Okay. I'm gonna get the bamboo now. Okay, there's this one. And all you need to do is just break. Like lean it down, break, and it will break naturally. Ah! Let's go for a few more. We're gonna make bamboo salad, and uh, my mom's gonna teach me how to do that. I'll write one more over here. This millipede is just everywhere. You want to try some? It's eating the breaking like breaking bamboo. 
And all the little ones. And you have them. Look at all the little ones. Two more over here. One. Two. <laughs> my, mom, my mom breaking this on me like, pick it. I was like, where? Behind you. It's like, where? It's so blending. Man, what again? I told her I'm going to pick it up, but she just keep picking it up. Guys, there's no good man or picking. There's a uh, mom says there's one over here, but I don't see any. My mom has very good eyesight. Oh, here yeah. inside the little one. More over here. Alright guys, we're gonna go down and I'm gonna show you the process of making bamboo shoot salad. It's a local village grilled fish with lao khao Thai biscuit. You come to Thailand, I dare you to try that lao khao. Hey, long, lay, no? Long. Hey, tang chat, long, lay. My Thai is long. You come to Thailand, you must try. and her dog this one I call Poppy but she's like so big and her personality is just like golden retriever hmm? Hmm? in my backyard we surround with this plant that look like weed but it's not weed it's tapioca and we grow this one this one made for uh, powder I mean flower tapioca flowers surprisingly this is what MSG made from tapioca home we see how much we get I broke my tripod <laughs> get the knife out we went for a quick like probably 10 minutes and we don't go that far so the higher you go more the biggest the bamboo is so we need to peel it and I'm not sure how but I'm gonna let my mom teach me how to peel it we're gonna watch it later though. Like this. I'm gonna my mom told me. And then tear it. Oh my god, it's quite hard actually. That. <laughs> okay, do more. Okay, cut like this. All right, getting there. But be careful though, this is very itchy. <laughs> I can't recommend you to go. But if you wanna um, experience the Thai life, then I recommend you to do it. Let's do the big one. Let's do the big one. I'm gonna sit on the floor. What? Get all the skin now. <laughs> Wow, this one huge. This one huge. Bad <laughs> milk, I said, take all the meat out. My mom, like, you're not coming to the mountain with me ever again. I think it's better to let my mom do it. Mad ham, mad ham, Let's, let's see my professional do night, do they? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, let's see the professional. Wow. Show yai le, ah show yai le, this one. Don. One second for one, um, one second. I mean, ten second for one bamboo. Meanwhile, it take me um, three minutes to peel one. We're gonna boil it right now. Put it in the same pot because this pot has been boiling for like um, thirty minutes, four to five minutes. But it's okay. And go get to do this one done. <laughs> it's very itchy though, careful. Wear a glove if you can. Put it in right now. You see, they have two type of um, bamboo shoot. That one is slide, and that one we're gonna keep it in the bottle, and that will preserve it to last longer. But if you want to make a bamboo salad, we keep in the like a like a stick. I don't even know what it called. But no, but no. And then we're gonna shred it with knife or fork. And then cover it for two hours. We keep at the charcoal, put it in the low to medium heat and let it steam in there. Okay, now this is another way to eat it, like um, easy way is to boil it and then dipping with this sauce. This sauce is, um, I think called shrimp paste in Thai called Nam Pikapi. And then with rice, with eggplant, deep fried with um, egg, and then batu fish. And then all you do is just like dipping. I'm gonna get this piece, the outside piece, my favorite. And then dipping it. Yum, yum, yum. Mm. All right, ma. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This is my auntie. Look at the side of my auntie and my one. And the, she's like professional. Over here they have more. And she said in the back, they even more. Look at this. Wow, look at the side. Look at that. Whoa, more. Next level, huh? She's like professional. The bamboo. There's a fade, it's like a season. They would be like, okay, they open season for picking the bamboo and then they will close it. So they're very, very strict with it over the years. Make sure that we don't collect all the bamboo and we have no bamboo tree left on the mountain. Oh, that's a frog. I'm gonna go in the bush to get one ingredient. Jordan can wait here, baby. I'll go in. In the night, it was in the back. I'm coming, whatever that should be in the ground. Just watch out, okay? <laughs> I need this one. My mom gonna tell me off she found out if I come here alone. Whatever it is, I'm coming. Oh, like a huge snail. You see that? Oh, I don't wanna step on them. Oh. This is the thing that I come for. This one called Bayanang. I just need a few of them. This Bayanang have the benefits of the fixing the fe uh, fever. If you have fever, you have this one Bayanang. I just need a few to boil with the bamboo. Okay, all done. Now this is the main ingredient that you need, the bamboo that we go collect on the mountain and Bayanang. But first, we're gonna share this one first with fork. See this? You shade it this way. I like my one very skinny. 
like really the little one and then you move to this one but sometimes at the end it's hard I don't know why I tell you this, this is my first time doing it too <laughs> uh, I think actually I did it before when I was a kid but I don't know the right way to explain to you but this pretty much it is easy but make sure you shade like as some people like it big like you can just slide it and then just I mean cut it with a knife but my one I prefer this one and then at the end here see there it is so easy and then we're gonna do the rest This one is the hard bit, very hard and crispy. We're not gonna use this this bit. We can just get the top of it, and this is pretty much it. Like make it like a noodles. Now the next step is we're gonna crunch the juice out from this leaf. Okay, to get the juice out of it, all you need is just a little bit of the water, and then the leaf. Add it in. And all you do is just squeeze. Squeeze until this water is nice and green. Or you can bend it with the blender or smash it with uh, the pestle and mortar. And there you go, Nam Bayanang. Now the next step is to boil these two together. Before I turn the heat on, I'm gonna just put the bayanang juice in here first and then not my bamboo chew. Turn on the stove. And then my mom said boil them until they change color. See? Until the bamboo absorbs the color of this herb leaf. Give it 10 minutes. Wow, look at it changing the color. I'm gonna turn the heat off now. Let's do it. The pot look <laughs> nasty. <laughs> oh, it absorbed all the soup. I think this is it. I think she's enough. Wow. I'm gonna change the pot for more advertising. <laughs> now we're gonna seasoning the bamboo. See the bamboo turning color now? I actually boiled this one for I think 20 minutes and it's the perfect color. This is how I looking for when I go to the restaurant try to get a good bamboo salad but we'll see if I can crack that recipe out. So the ingredient is very simple. This is like Isan food and of course you can't miss the pickle fish sauce. I use this brand, always use this brand but some people prefer their own pickle fish and fish sauce always the one that I use and I got MSG <laughs> can't miss that one and then this is a um, special ingredient of uh, Isan food is roasted rice crushed roasted rice and then what you need what else is cilantro Thai cilantro chalad and lime that's it if you want spicy you can add the um, um, the chili, chili flake. Okay, we're gonna add um, fish sauce now. Voila. MSG. Lime. This looks good. I wanna add like chili so bad. But no chili for me now. Actually, do you know what? This one are not supposed to taste. Um, what is it called? Sour. It's supposed to taste noa. Noa inisan mean um, umami flavor. 
the mixed combination of saltiness and sweetness from the bamboo that very umami flavor from pala a little bit of um, sour but not that much and then we add this one in these two oh I forgot to add roasted rice mix everything together do you know what would be good with this one? grilled pork neck mm, yes Let me try this. Maybe we have to add other thing else. Anything else in? Let me try. Oh my god. I'm good. <laughs> mm. Oh my god. That's it. Bamboo salad, a very easy to make test test. These are people cook very good food. Mm. Mm. Still not bad. Oh my god. Mm. Now that I know how to cook this one now, this is gonna be what I'm gonna be eating every day. And it's very healthy. The bamboo is like would you considering this bamboo is organic because we just went housing and no one will put fertilizer on that mountain and also the same with the the leaf just grow by its own in the backyard so nice mm. Mm. yummy i hope you guys enjoy this video i have fun making this video and if you do don't forget to like and subscribe to my channels and i'll see you in the next video bye, -bye.